Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Creative Stampers team, and today I'm excited to share with you some more ideas from the Heartfelt Stamp Set and the Heart Punches. I know that Valentine's Day just passed, and you may be thinking, well now what am I going to do with all this heart stuff that I have? Or maybe you didn't even purchase Valentine's set and the heart punches because you, you think it's Valentine's Day and then once Valentine's Day is over, I can't do anything with it. So I wanted to create a video showing some different ideas that you can you do using the heart punches and the heart belt stamp set after Valentine's Day. So I'm going to start by, um, I've already pre-punched a bunch of the hearts from the regular heart punch and the scalloped one. And then I just um, glued them all down on this crumb cake sheet. I'm just gonna show you this cool idea. So then I'm just gonna trim off all of the hearts around the edges. This is a really cool technique. You can really do it with any kind of punch, but I thought it was cute with the hearts and I loved this color combination. So I have crumb cake on the back and mossy meadow and Rococo rose are my colors here. And then I'm going to bring in my die cutting machine and I'm going to use this coastal weave embossing folder. And I'm just going to put the whole thing in there. So the, the page here with my hearts already on and I'm going to run it all through with that coastal weave embossing folder. And you can see it'll come out with the whole design all over the cute hearts. And then I'll put it a back on it and let me show you the finished product here. From my heart to yours. And I use some of that cute Rococo Rose ribbon there. So cute and so fun. You can use this for any occasion really. So fun. So let me show you a few more ideas. In the Heartfelt stamp set there's a saying that says, so lucky to have a friend like you and I thought that went so well with St. Patrick's Day. So I made a shamrock using the heart punches and I even used the hearts from the set here and made a cute shamrock there. So lucky to have a friend like you. So then I was really inspired to do some more punch art and I thought the hearts kind of looked like butterfly wings. So I made this set, this card here, Love You Lots with a cute little butterfly. And then this one, Love You Lots with this cute paper. So I made this card using this cute heart paper. It comes in the Pleased as Punch designer series paper. It's available February 4th through the end of March while supplies last. It's this cute paper, let me show you. There's this one with the heart, so it coordinates with the heart punch. It, there's this cute one with the umbrellas. There's that cute umbrella punch that's in the mini catalog, so it coordinates there. This cute tulip one with the punch. And then the celebration punch, that little mini flower punch, that coordinates too. So this designer series paper, you get 12 sheets for $11.50, you get three sheets of four different designs. So it's really cute and fun and bright and it coordinates with that fun heart punch. So I just wanted to show you that too. So I, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you got some ideas of using hearts in a way that isn't a Valentine way. Um, you can use hearts all year long, especially I feel like in the spring and summertime, it's just a really fun time to tell someone that you love them. So let us know if you have any questions. If you like this video, make sure to give us a thumbs up and we'll see you next time for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.